What is up everybody? I'm going to check out the new props here with the Evo 2. See how they work out. They should be okay. I just did that test and with the uh, props and the uh, the old props and the new props and the new props are quieter. There is no doubt about that. I think about 8 decibels. So that uh, seemed to be okay. Let me start the video up. some lag in that video. Okay, so the app disconnected, completely crashed. The phone completely crashed. The phone reset. Okay, so that's a new one. That, I've never seen that happen, flying a drone, where the, actually the phone shut down. I gotta say, that's a first. So you know the screen recorded and went in the toilet. You knew something was going on with all that lag. Yes, it is. It's coming after you, John. <laughs> does that have a on? Yes, it does. It's looking right at you. All right, John. I will tell you, it's a lot quieter with this. It's a lot quieter with those props, man. I'm telling you. Boy, oh boy. Get away from that car over there. Like I said, I just wanted to check out with the props how it was going to fly. It's getting a little dusky here. So all that lag and all that now is stopped. So I don't know what the heck that was about. Maybe the phone was glitching up or something. I mean, who knows, right? Let me, uh, Kind of getting dark. I 
tried to lighten up the video there a little bit, but it didn't seem like it did anything. Like it took a couple of seconds for it to kick in. I don't know why it's doing this hesitating. Is it seeing something or is the obstacle avoidance tripping it? Okay, so I turned that off. The obstacle avoidance on this seems to be way more prevalent than the than the other one. You know what I mean? It's like more 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 avoidance. Get out of here. Okay, so I'm going to probably not use the obstacle avoidance on this thing. Let me check these EV settings again. I don't like, um, a big fan of constant warnings and all of that I mean I'm not a real big crasher of drones as far as these kind I don't think I've ever tore one up of all the ones I have and all the flights I've done so I just most of the time I actually watch what the heck I'm doing you know what I mean so I don't think uh, this obstacle avoidance is gonna be something I'm gonna be needing I'm gonna mess with the settings and slow down the slow down some of the yawing and the you know the pitch and all that I'm gonna see if I can slow that down some but as far as the optical avoidance stuff I'm probably gonna leave it off because I really don't like let me stop the video I really don't like that kind of I just don't like the way it was act the way it acts with that it's too much obstacle avoidance okay you know constantly giving you these warnings and all this crap and it's stopping somewhere when you think it's gonna keep going you don't you're like messing with the sticks going why ain't it moving why ain't it reacting because it's, it's, <coughs> it's seeing something <coughs> so it's gonna stop it or you know limit your input I don't like that so we're going to uh, we're going to work on this. I got off the rest of the year to fiddle around with this thing. So, all right, guys. I got to take this out to one of those places and stretch this thing out a little bit. I've never actually flown this thing that far except over at that park. Um, I need to take it a couple thousand out and fart around with it for a minute. All right, guys.
Have a nice day. I'll talk to you later.